Hello, this video will show you how to install the Octave software into your computer on a Windows, uh, Microsoft Windows operating system. The first step that you have to do is to download the Octave console mode, which is the uh, execution mode uh, with no graphical interface. Then a second step will be to download the QT Octave, which is the graphics interface for the same uh, program than before. Let's uh, start with the first step. To download the Octave, we just have to go in the Google and ask for Octave in the SourceForge website. We just uh, go here directly and we have here the page of the Octave software where you can download the software of the of the execution mode but what we are going to do is just to take the binary for Windows so we just have to click on the Windows installer wait for the download window to open Here it is, and you can see that we can now save this uh, file in our uh, folders. I did that before in order to, ha to keep short the video, uh, so we are not going to save now, but you should do that at home. Instead, we are going to cancel, and here in the download, we have this icon, which represents is the, the executable that we just have. Uh, download. We have to open it, apply for execution, and in a while it pop up a uh, Windows installer view. Typical one, you have to just go next, next, and next. We uh, uh, confirm the license agreement, we confirm the directory, the folder where the software is going to be installed and uh, we can uh, pick up several mm, uh, add-ons on the mm, software these the ones that are in default it's okay and we just have to uh, press install to install that in our computer we did that also already but uh, in order to be short but you have to again uh, give a uh, click on install button okay we have done that then after installing the uh, octave console mode we will go again to the Google and ask now for QT Octave and let's ask for Windows 1 and we will look for this one that is in Red Iris website we click on this link and this uh, page web it's open we have to now select this QT Octave.exe, which is already uh, again an installer. We just click on that, and again the download window will pop up. And as before, we have to uh, save this folder into our um, save this file into our folder. We have done that before, but we you should press again save, and you will get. Uh, at the end of the downloading process you will get this uh, uh, file that again you have to open and execute and going again through the typical uh, Windows installer that's the uh, folder where there is going to be installed Okay, uh, you can also create an I icon if you want in the um, desktop. And finally, again, you just press install and the software will be installed. At the end, we, s we abort this. At the end, what we have is in our menu, which you should have these two new buttons. And the one we want to select is this one to execute and prove that everything has gone fine 
select this one okay and some place there is hide this uh, menu you just have to empty this one and this is the final view of the Qt just working okay in the next video we will show how to uh, work with this environment okay hope that you have no problems to download your software